Hello friends and welcome back to the channel. My name is Blaine and it's a rainy Thursday. You know what those are good for, right? Thrifting. It's Thrifting Thursday, y'all. Today we are specifically looking for some blank VHS tapes, um, or at least sold as blank, uh, for a little project that I've been working on. Uh, hopefully going to come out to the channel soon, but let's go to our first stop. It might be our only stop today. But um, so be it, if it is. So let's see what they've got here. All right, so our first stop was a bust. Didn't find anything I was interested in, so um, let's see if we can find somewhere else. All right, so went into store number two. It's a pawn shop, so I couldn't really video in there, but we're headed into store number three. Then I'll show y'all what we found. Now, unfortunately, today our stops were a bit of a bust. Uh, however, we can't go home empty-handed. I did get a couple things that I'll show you here in a minute, but we have one last stop that we have just made uh, before I have to head back from my lunch break, um, and that is none other than the red-headed restaurant queen herself, Wendy's boy. We hungry. We gotta eat in the car on the way home. On the way on the way back to work, we gotta eat in the car. All right, friends. So after finishing our biggie bag with a junior bacon cheeseburger, six nugs, a medium fry, and a medium vanilla coke, we went back to work. We got the job done. You know what I'm saying? It's five o'clock, we're out of there. So now let's just check out what we got today from our stops. Now, we only purchased things from one stop uh, and it was that pawn shop that I didn't wanna record in just because it's so small and intimate. Uh, kinda be weird to kinda walk around with a camera, I don't know. Uh, they might look at me a little weird, but we did get a few things and um, I think I spent, if I'm not mistaken, $4.50 um, <laughs> for all of these, and if I'm not, it, I'm gonna be honest, it's a good deal. It's a good deal. So, first and foremost, we got Secret Life of Pets on Blu ray. Uh, I can't remember if I've got this one or not, but I don't think I do. So, um, yeah, what, what more can I say? Got that on Blu ray, beautiful uh, disc, and uh, great condition. We also got Crawl. I was excited to see this one. Still haven't watched it yet. Um, I've never seen this one. DVD release and beautiful copy as well. So that was a great pickup. It's one I was wanting to see when it first came out but never got to. Um, next we got The Psycho Legacy. This was a really good find. This is probably my favorite find of the bunch. Um, the ultimate retrospective of the most influential horror series of all time. Uh, and it's got, of course, the double disc here. Uh, it does have the feature presentation. This is a Shout Factory release, which is amazing that I just found this for like 50 cents or whatever, or a dollar. Um, and uh, it's, it's, I just love the, the artwork on here. Uh, now I do have the Psycho Blu-ray set with all of them, but I've only seen the first movie, so Hopefully, as soon as I watch those, I can just pop this in right afterwards. Uh, I'm assuming this is a documentary of sorts, um, and it's also even got bonus features, so that's exciting. Uh, I'm super, super pumped for this one. It's going to be a great watch. And lastly, we got a an Xbox 360 game, Fear 3. Can't believe I found this for such a cheap price. Typically, this one goes uh, for a little bit more expensive just because it is... 
um, a part of the Fear series, and it's kind of a horror action shooter kind of series. Uh, this was the only Fear that I played. The disc is it's okay. It's it's in pretty good condition, but it's got some scratches here and there. But um, I did play Fear Three when it first came out. This is the only one I did play. I just blinded myself. That hurts so bad. Um, and I loved this game. Now, since then, uh, I sold my 360 version, or I traded it into GameStop or something. Big regret, big mistake. Um, always wanted to get it back, but it was always a little bit more expensive than I was willing to pay for it. I uh, ended up finding it for a good price. Not a great price, but an okay price at um, uh, on whatnot for PS3. But then I just found this one on 360. So, uh, super pumped for that find. So uh, we did get those four items for $4.50 at that pawn shop. We didn't find anything else uh, at any of the other stops, which is unfortunate, but hey, it is what it is. That's thrifting Thursday for you. Uh, and it's now a sunny Thursday. Man, the weather really changed today. Um, but thank you so much for watching. Tune in next time. Uh, hopefully we'll have some some different stops we'll, we'll take. Um, but, uh, of course, as always, when the streetlight comes on, come on home.